Hello everyone and welcome back to another train simulator video. Yes, this is the second one in a row, uh, but I didn't actually record anything on the 25th. Obviously, it was my birthday, so I just did this the day before. I thought I did two, a couple of train simulator videos. Anyway, welcome driver, open the doors and allow passengers to board. You will be leaving Kenley at 16.42, so we don't actually have long. So let's get the doors open. There you go, there they go. Cool. But yeah, this is in the standard class 377. Obviously, this is not the AP one. Um, and uh, we are on the... Well, this is uh, one of the scenarios as part of the uh, London to Brighton uh, Rygate expansion. Obviously, which is uh, Rivet Games' is, um, DLC, actually. Obviously, London to Brighton itself is Dovetail Games, but the Rygate expansion is from Rivet Games. Passengers have now boarded the train. Please proceed at 1642, and the next one is Purley. So, at the moment, we're at Kenley. Hello, the doors are still closing. No, they're shut now. Anyway, let's get going. And so, we are coupling up to another train, which will be cool. But let's go. And obviously, I do want to say a big thanks to Rivet Games for actually giving us the key to show off the um, London Brighton Rygate expansion. Also, because they actually did share it on uh, social media, on Twitter, uh, fairly recently. So, yeah, big thanks for that as well. But yeah, we're taking this up to Norwood Junction, this service. Um, so, it's not too far. It said about 20 minutes, this scenario. But let's get going. Let's get a bit of speed on us. Whilst we can as it goes down to 20 soon. That because we're connecting to another train. Which is quite a cool procedure. When in fact we will actually have to come to a stop. Um, as yeah, obviously we've got another train to connect up to. So we have to contact the sig stop, contact the signaller and then put it into Pearly. So let's start bringing that down. But yeah, this is the Brighton Main Line. So obviously yesterday's video we looked at the Reza to Dresden, obviously coming to train some world two. And now on the Bright Main Line, which obviously is coming to train some world two. Obviously not this specific bit. Uh, but once we get to Purley we'll be on the proper main line. Cool. Bring that down. In a minute we will stop. We'll stop at the red light. Um, press tab, which obviously contacts the signaller. Oh no, you will need to call... Oh, that's... Uh, okay. Yeah, press... To, oh god, everything's going off at once. There you go, it's all good. And... And... and, and but yeah, this is the uh, vintage, uh, vintage catering scenario, this one. Here we are. So let's come to a stop, then we'll contact the signaller. And then we shall proceed into Purley. Uh, yeah, contact the signaller, so press tab, and we can go through. It says approved, it's got the calling on signal, it says you can go. So let's go. Cool. Let's make our way forward. Yeah, 20 miles an hour around here as we join up with the main line. Round we go. Little whistle action. So yeah, halfway down the platform we will actually come across another train. Uh, obviously yeah, that is the one we're going to be connecting up to. But round we go. Cool. So it's Pearly. Um... Pearly Oak, South Croydon, East Croydon, and then Norwood Junction. And I think we are stopping at. I think we're stopping at each of those stations, I think. Yeah, Pearly Oak, South Croydon, Croydon, Norwood Junction. Cool. And there is the other train in the platform there. So let's be careful. We don't want to crash into it straight away. Obviously, then we'll have to change cab as well. I've seen this operation many times before. Not at this station. I've seen it at Horsham uh, and Hayward Safe. 
connecting the trains up. It's quite cool. Fairly simple though. Obviously not as you know, not as manic as it was back in the day where you had to put all the wires across and all the pipes and all that. Well, not pipes, but obviously nowadays it just slots in. Always stop just before you go in. And let's get into that camera. That's very best. And oh god, what am I doing? Let's get a screenshot of that. I don't know why, but just yeah. And roll forward. Bit more, bit more. There we go, easy as that. You successfully coupled to 377212. Now open the doors and prepare for departure. There we go. So we now need to change cab so we can shut this one down. Uh, fairly simple in the 377. There we go. That should be all good. So now we change cabs. There we go. Uh, did we, hang on a second. We did, did we even have the headlights on in the last one? Did we not have the headlights on? I don't think we did, or did we? I don't know, I thought it would have been automatic, because the rest of the train was set up automatically. London Bridge. Obviously, I don't think they would actually run these services anymore. It would be um, Thameslink doing this. Obviously, it is um, probably set a few years back. Right, next station is Pearly Oaks. Bing, 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 bing. Let's go. See, so yeah, Purdy Oaks next, and then South Croydon, East Croydon, and then Norwood Junction. Yeah, off we go. Still fairly slow out of here, 20 miles an hour, but you can see the speed does go up. Cool. Lovely. Right, off we go again. And let's get that down. Then we got 25. Let's get that up. Lovely. Now you'll be able to get up to 60 in a second. We're now an 8 car service. So a fairly longish service. And let's get the speed up. Let's just go full, full throttle. Let's go, we're not messing around here. There's another train now, so we'll be waiting for us to come across. A little bit of speed. But yeah, if you are enjoying the video, do leave a thumbs up and even do subscribe if you do want to see more. Obviously, do plenty of, plenty of um, TS and TSW. But yeah, if you do want to see more, do subscribe. It will just help out. And here we are, Pearly Oaks. Yeah, they're very close to one another, the stations coming into East Croydon. And also, realistically, you also see the 455 doing services around here. Which is always sort of cool to see the comparison, because, you know, one minute you might get a 377 coming along, which is all nice and newish. And then, um, obviously, then you get the 455s coming along, rattling along. I suppose it's to the end of the platform here. Yeah, end of the platform here. Looks like it can only accommodate an eight coach service. Here we are. Right doors. Pearly Oaks. Another service. Lovely. One of the fast ones. Probably up from Brighton, that one. 12 cars as well. Got that whizzing through. Awesome. But now we wait. There you go. Next station stop is South Croydon. Let's get a screenshot because why not? Um, let's go. Cool, not too far. Uh, East Croydon and then Norwood Junction. 
I think we are actually stopping at Norwood Junction, aren't we? Yeah, pick up passengers. So it's only three miles away. Obviously, we've got a couple of stations beforehand. But let's go. And then we come into the hustle and bustle of East Croydon Station. Let's get that up. There you go, full full 100% on the throttle there. Sixty. But yeah, all close to one another along here. And the signal blocks are very skinny as well. Is that already a word set? Skinny signal blocks? The very small signal blocks, that's probably the best there. Uh, or the better vocab for it. That comes down to 45 after South Croydon. But here we are approaching it now. Cool. But yeah, it's a nice chilled out train sim vid. Um, yeah, it's nice and chilled. Down to 30 miles an hour when we come into the platform. Cool. I think it was also a, well not a short platform, but I think it can't accommodate 12 coaches here, so um, we can't come in too quickly. I'll probably be stopping at the end of the platform. What's that double yellow we've got there? Uh, looks like a double yellow, yeah. Yeah, I think it is to the end of the platform here. I was thinking realistically, I think there's usually always eight coach services that come along here. I don't think you'd ever get a 12 coach coming along. Well, this bit specifically, as um, the stations are too short. Or the platforms are too short. Cool. But South Croydon. The station before them had this. Looks like we arrived on time as well, um, so we're doing there in about three minutes. So, well, I mean, it's literally just there. So, I suppose we're just waiting for this signal. Um, still double yellow. So, I think at the end of East Croydon platform, oh, it's it's gone out green. Good. There you go. Passengers now boarded. Doors are closing. A fast one coming along. I can see a fast one coming along as well. But off we go. Whoa, not into a hundred. Okay, we'll put it into a hundred then. So another twelve coach service. No, nope, another uh, another eight coach. But let's get going. But yeah, I think I've done most of the scenarios now in the um, London Brighton Rygate pack. Uh, I believe you get. Oh, I think it's uh, five scenarios. I believe in the pack. Um, so yeah, it's not bad. And obviously the Rygate branch as well, uh, which is a brilliant addition. Also, I think it's also around seven. Yeah, I think it's seven pound ninety nine to get um, the pack, but you do need to own the Brighton mainline route as well, uh, which Rivet Games actually do do a bundle on their store. Uh, I think they're still doing it, where you can get um, the Brighton mainline and this pack um, for. 10% less than if you brought them separately on Steam. Right, here we are, East Croydon Station. Been there a fair few times in real life, and you know, changing trains here, um, even doing work experience. We're not here, but at the um, go ahead house, whatever it was called, up, um, well, pretty, pretty much next to the station. I wouldn't say it's the most pleasant of stations. It's always really busy and it seems like it's always under construction work. Or at least when I've been there, it's always been busy and construction work and all that. But it's a, yeah, a very busy station, this one. Where's the stop marker? I think it's tucked away behind the waiting shelter, isn't it? Yeah, there it is, the eight coach stop. Here we are. 
This is East Croydon. Yeah, but I think the um, Go Ahead House. I think it is called the Go Ahead House where the work experience. That is. I remember walking along the road here, you get the trams sort of just going, doing ding ding everywhere. It'll be somewhere here. Uh, probably there. So I remember, I think there was. You came out of here. Oh, uh, yeah, it was this big building here. Then you've got like a Tesco. I think it was a Tesco or Sainsbury's, which was sort of where that patch is there. Now, if this is set in 2012, it's been quite redeveloped uh, recently. Yeah, I think Tesco was there, or Sainsbury's, and then you went along there with the trams, and there was a place there for the Go Ahead house. Which obviously Go Ahead do a lot of the bits and bobs. Right. At Norwood Junction next. Let's go. Oh, what could R mean? Mm, I suppose right. I'm just trying to think because usually it means, um, you know, say E or at Brighton means East Coast Way. W would mean West Coast Way. So I wonder what R means. I suppose, yeah, possibly right. Don't know. Yeah, Norwood Junction next is our next stop. Didn't take too long to get there. So much just out of here, turn to the right and we're there. I'll get the speed up in a second. But yeah, so if you continued past Norwood Junction, it would take you to uh, London Bridge. And um, that's what sort of goes off that way. If you continued. Now let's get the speed up. Lovely. Get up a little bit more. There you go. Right, off we go. So making our way, well, to normal junction. Going under the, well, the, well, I mean, this is sort of, well, this is where the Brighton Main Line splits off. As the Brighton Main Line isn't just A to B. Um, the Brighton Main Line goes from Brighton to London, Victoria and London Bridge. Um, so this is, well, this is the other bit that goes off. This is the not as main bit, I suppose. Not so main bit. Um, yeah. Well, see, a little reminder. For Train Some World 2, we are getting the London Victoria to Brighton section. Well, even on this game, it's uh, Victoria to Brighton. As that's sort of the main southern and pretty much the only Gatwick Express bit. It's realistically off this way now, it's mostly Thameslink trains. You've got Selhurst Depot on the left, which I think is one of the main southern depots. I've actually been inside it before and work experience. And here we are, Norwood Junction. Let's get the speed down. Maybe down a little bit more. And it's also one of those stations where you get a platform on both sides of the train. Um, if you look over to the left there, that you can see it. Which I suppose is... I don't know why they did it. I suppose it's just to do with capacity. I suppose it sort of just makes sense to, you know, tell people oh, get off the right-hand side, then people get on from the left-hand side, or something like that. You know, you have two platforms instead of one to hold people. As there's uh, the only other state, well, not the only other stage, well, there's actually quite a few stations, but another one I've been to is Finsbury Park. That's got it as well, and even Horse to the Kings. Right, here we are. Norwood Junction, we made it, but that is the vintage Caterham scenario. Obviously, in the Rivet Games London to Brighton Rygate expansion pack. Um, but that is going to be it. Uh, thanks all for coming in. Obviously, we'll find a link in the description to the Discord server, to the PayPal, and to the merch store if you do want to help support the channel. Yeah, thanks all for coming in, and I hope we'll see you next time. See you all. Take care. Bye, guys.